Wow, Sunday evening, class is over, uh, motorcycle class. It was a good class overall. Um, they went longer than I expected. Uh, I suppose part of that is, is seemed the class overall was doing uh, better than some other classes. Each of the students were doing well. So early on, you start getting an expectation. Oh, you know, we're going to get through this a little early, and uh, that didn't happen. We we stayed pretty much the whole time, which is okay. That's why the class is designed as long as it is, and they have that much time to do it. So. Um, I started thinking a little bit about the students this weekend, and, and uh, we spend kind of two days with them. We spend a little bit of Friday night with them, but they're doing their e-course and they're wrapped up in that, so there's not a lot of interaction with them. And so we have sun, Saturday and Sunday out on the range and in the classroom where we're, uh, we we interact with them. And you know, even though it is, it's kind of two full days, you don't uh, you don't really get a chance to to get to know anybody um it was uh think back to the the class i took and uh, one of the instructors uh, so we would do the range portion and after class then eat lunch pretty much together and then head back to the classroom and, and do that because the, the range and the classroom were at two different locations and i remember the instructor kind of both days uh asking each of the students where do you work you know what do you do and and, and that and um, so while I teach, you know, most of the students go off into different places for lunch and I stay there and I eat my lunch. Occasionally I'll go out and anyway, it's not a, not a, a whole lot of chance to, to meet or to, to learn more about students. Every once in a while if somebody's hanging around and may ask them, what do you, what do you do? Or, you know, something like that. And that's about it. And, uh, this weekend was a, a, a little bit different, um, in class, sometimes you'll have a father and a son or a married couple or a mom and a daughter or, you know, whatever. And in this class, uh, we actually had a husband and a wife and a father and a son. So kind of fam. Oh, and two, and two brothers. So definitely uh, family, more family oriented. And then uh, at lunchtime, uh, the two brothers, uh, one of the brothers had his wife and two kids show up. So, and then the other guy was obviously the uncle and... Uh, it was really cute. Uh, the kid, the younger kid, I think he was about four, um, going up to the, the dry right board and drawing stuff. And, and you just saw the interaction. And, you know, the, the wife was there. And, and uh, you get a you get a get more of a picture of the person, you know, and you, and you see this. And, uh, you know, I kind of miss that a little bit. And like I said, we, we, we spend two days with, the, with these people, but we, we don't get to know them very well. It's just more of the interaction of, of teaching them motorcycle class and, and getting them on their way. And, and that's the, the objective. And just reminded me, you know, I was riding home thinking about it and saying, you know, I, I know this, but it was a, a kind of a reminder that uh, when, when you meet people, you don't, you don't really know them, but uh, everybody has a story and say, you know, treat everybody kindly because you, you don't necessarily know what they've been through or what they're going through. And so today was a bit of a reminder of that, thinking, you know, that just like us, we, we have families, we have stories and, and that, and, you know, that's, I, I don't know, I, there's not, a, I don't want to make excuses, it doesn't seem like a lot of time to, to get to know people, but I'm sure that they, they all have their families and their stories, and I know there are some interesting ones in there, maybe it's missed opportunity. Anyway, that's, that's kind of my thought for tonight. Um, Treat everybody nice. Uh, you don't know what they're going through or what they've been through and how they might be able to help you one day. So anyway, have a great evening. Uh, mine's going to be fantastic, and I will talk to you tomorrow.